Hi, this is Mari with uh, Green Woman Ways, and I'm out here just uh, outside of Mount Bachelor Ski Area having a gorgeous blue sky powdery snow underneath day on my snowshoes. And uh, today's tip for nature connection and getting outside and wild play is uh, all about girl power. So this is for you girls out there. Um, for the adventurous women at heart, and for those that want to stir up their adventurous uh, hearts as well. So, um, a lot of people, when they find out that I go snowshoeing in the wilderness by myself, kind of like freak out. And uh, they like get these big eyes and like, oh my god, aren't you afraid to be out there? And aren't you afraid of this? And aren't you afraid of that? And uh, honestly, no, I'm not. And um, I think that comes from a lot of different things. One thing is probably partly my personality and uh, just don't tend to be fearful of the wilderness and of nature. Uh, the other is that I've been coming out here um, all my life. I've been doing this for <laughs> uh, since I was a little kid. Um, so I'm 38 now, so I've got 38 years of being out, out in the wilderness, out in the backcountry, out in the uh, great outdoors. And I was raised that way. So I think over time you build up a lot more confidence and skills. And uh, being a naturalist and um, being an outdoors woman, I have those skills that make me feel a lot more confident out here. Although, I will say that I'm also very respectful and I'm very cautious um, in the sense that I make sure I'm planned ahead. I check the weather. I make sure that I'm checking the weather that actually is good for the mountains. NOAA is great for that. Um, I make sure that I pack things that I need just in case there is some sort of emergency. So I always have like a bivy sack with me, which is sort of a single person tent like thing that you crawl into. Um, I have extra layers with me for warmth. I have extra food with me. Uh, things like that. I also um, will carry a GPS and use it on occasion where I'm at today. I don't really need it so I'm not heading out too far today. Um, but I won't even rely completely on a GPS because batteries can fail. Even if you have extras it can be really cold. So I know to have backup upon backup. Um, and it's not really like out of fear, it's just more out of respect for the wilderness. I've been in the mountains um, when completely unexpected storms have come in. They weren't even forecasted. So I've learned that having those extra things is really good. Um, I've also learned that <laughs> I'd rather just be out here than sitting at home afraid to go out and do what I love. So uh, that's another thing that kind of motivates me getting out here. So. This one is about women, especially um, feeling more confident about going out into the wilderness on your own. It's about, um, you know, I just want to encourage you to learn the skills that you feel you need and uh, to feel more confident getting out there, whether it's in the winter like, uh, like it is now or even during um, the rest of the year. A lot of people won't even go out during uh, the summer and such as well. So. Um, learn those skills and if you have questions on what kind of skills that you think would be good to learn um, I'm, I'm here you can always shoot me an email uh, my email address and contact is on Green Moon Ways or uh, you can contact me on my Facebook page as well Green Moon Ways on Facebook and uh, I'm happy to give you some pointers and uh, there are a lot of opportunities for women to learn a lot of the skills that will help them get out there and also uh, you know, you're always responsible for your own well-being, ultimately, no matter what. So um, don't go beyond what you're comfortable with, but definitely don't let fear keep you from getting out there. Because nature connection in the winter, especially, is some of the most peaceful time I have out here. And uh, I'm out here year-round, but um, there's just something about that blanket of snow. There's something about the winter landscape and... Uh, the energy of the place that just really soothes and I just I can't stop grinning my cheeks usually hurt afterwards just because it's just so beautiful out here I mean the snow is sparkling and uh, it's spectacular so I just want to encourage you women out there not to be afraid to get out there and uh, be in the wilderness be out in the snow be out hiking and uh, stuff on your own if you uh, feel like you can step out in that direction and give it a try I recommend it it's uh it's major retreat time it's like solo time for yourself that uh is well worth it and incredibly rejuvenating 
and um, so yeah so that's your tip for today and uh, I found a tree to lean against here which is pretty nice usually when you're out here snowshoeing you can't quite find trees that you can get too close to because of the snow wells and uh, they're kind of deep there but this tree just happened to be packed up right up against it thanks tree nice tree here everybody look at the tree nice little pine tree all right so nature connection blessings to all of you get out there and play and uh, have fun bye guys